<laughs> well, I'm back. Every time I go camping, I always make whackers. What's a whacker, Ranger Cookie? For example, if I came out here to this nice, beautiful park, there is always going to be some type of jerk or wild animal. So I create a whacker. A whacker is nothing but a stick or a device like this. It's just socks within a pair of socks, like three or four, and you can do damage while killing. So if a guy comes over here and starts messing with me, I can use this whacker. I'm show you. I'm gonna show you uh, some things you can do with the whacker or stick. I usually make a big fat stick where I can hit somebody if they mess with me or try to fool with me. It's good protection. Take a look at this again. So if somebody wanted to fool with me and I got the whacker. And believe it or not, what's in here, I'm going to show you what's in here so you can't say, Oh, you got a stick or a block in there. No, I do not. I make a whacker for a reason. To protect myself. So all it is is a couple socks within a sock. That's it. That's all. Three socks in one sock. It makes a good whacker. And this will protect me. I usually keep this close by when I'm camping. And I hope I never have to use the whacker or the stick. And that's how I do is find a long sock and put it in the sock. And that's how you do is beat it a couple times. And all the socks will go to the bottom. You can always stuff it in. And make it a ball tight. So when you're clapping, you don't want to use like deadly force or something that can really hurt somebody and we leave whelps. Depends on the situation. I have the whacker. All right, there you go. And I got the switch. See you in a few seconds. Now, this is called the switch. I might find a very heavy bamboo or stick. I found the bamboo. And if somebody wanted to mess with me, and I want to leave a whelp on him for or touching my stuff or messing around with me I use this this is a switch it's like the whacker or whackers that I create and this switch will leave a whelp on your victim if if you have anything any humans being jerks or animals being jerks in your part uh, your camping area this the sound of that will deter some jerks away from your camp so when you go camping we know we're not gonna have this in our campsites or parks it's very rare well, when I went to Virginia, I was attacked by a guy over my towels. So, uh, if you want more about that, let me know. I'll tell you about it. But, just in case somebody wants to be stupid with me, 
I have my whackers around my camp. If you go to Hobo, you got whackers everywhere, about trees. Just in case some animal or something, or I need to be, or I'm walking through the area to get wood, I have a whacker here, 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 here. I have whackers all along my trees that I walk around my camp. Just in case I have a wild animal, because there's supposed to be a cougar there. Not a cougar, bobcat. <laughs> Make sure I got it right. So I have whackers everywhere and little switches. So don't ever. I have rubber bands, I have whackers. That will put a whelp on somebody real bad. Alright, I'm Ranger Cookie. This is my whacker. Uh, I set up around my camp area if I have to. I hope I don't have to use them because the whackers do hurt, especially the switch type or the stick. And the other type of whacker is a big heavy duty stick. That means I want to kill you with that or really maim you. This would put a whelp on you. That would just hurt. And this is to really break bones and hurt you bad. And I hope I never have to use it on an animal or jerk human. If you know what I mean. We do have them out there. And we never know one day some jerk will come to a park and try to kill or hurt us while we're camping or hurt other civilians because they want to be a jerk. So I have a whacker or some type of defense mechanism around my campsite. I love the switch and the beater or the whacker. And I don't have a deadly one. I hope I don't need one. All right, I'm Ranger Cookie and this is my whacker video. Whacker whack.